the big question about what millions of us consider the best weapon to protect bones and beat back osteoporosis. Calcium and vitamin D. Nearly a quarter of us take the supplements. But tonight, a jolt. Some of the nation's top doctors are saying that for a lot of people, they're useless and might even do harm. Here's ABC's medical editor, Dr. Richard Besser. For millions of healthy women, it was taken as a given. When you reach menopause, you take calcium and vitamin D supplements for strong bones. Now a government panel has reviewed the evidence and says it's time to stop. The finding? Taking low-dose vitamin D and calcium does not prevent fractures and raises your risk of kidney stones. That dose of vitamin D we've known for a long time is probably too low. But for those who think an even higher dose is where you get the real benefits, the panel says there's not enough evidence that this works either. The jury is still out. Now, important to note, the panel's talking about supplements for healthy women. If you're being treated for osteoporosis or you're elderly and you're at increased risk of falling, by all means, continue your supplements. But, but for everyone else, Diane, this is a bit of a wake-up call. So no supplements? The supplements don't matter? They're saying that calcium and vitamin D matter, but the best way to get your calcium is from your diet. The best way to get vitamin D is from your diet and from the sun. And if you're getting enough that way, then you don't need supplements. Unless you're one of those proven deficient people. Okay, thanks so much, Rich.